your setup. So this video is all about tips and tricks to improve your efficiency when running a laser machine. Now the layout, the, the flow, it works obviously for a garage or a maker space, but also works for inside your home, right? Inside an office, uh, inside a bedroom. Lots of tips throughout, but one of the biggest ones is the standing desk, right? So a standing, sitting desk, auto adjust. Uh, this video is sponsored by FlexiSpot, uh, the maker of this desk. So I'll walk you through and I'll walk you through uh, all the all the features, uh, how easy it is to assemble. But there's a lot more in this video. Also tips on how to make this little thing right here, uh, which is a crazy efficiency booster. Uh, lots of other tips scattered throughout. So here you go, laser setup, standing desk tips, tricks, and more. To start off, just wanna show you the desk in use, uh, my normal workflow. So I usually start with some design work uh, at the computer, whether I'm looking for files online, designing it in the software. Uh, so here, obviously standing, but then, oh, I'm tired, can switch it down to sitting mode. Uh, so it is really nice and handy to be able to just push a button uh, to adjust. I do have another desk that kind of adjusts with the crank, uh, but I don't have as much um, you know, mobility as far as getting it as high or as low. So it's really nice just to make it uh, pre-programmed electronic. But, you know, go ahead. I got my pieces, got my material. Right now I'm adding this double stick tape uh, with this little attachment. Later in the video, I'll, I'll talk a little bit more about this in this process if you're unfamiliar with it and why this is just so much more efficient uh, for laser work. Uh, but here, actually running uh, something in the laser machine. Uh, you know, this is a desktop laser. A couple other ones that I have I'll, I'll talk about later. But um, if you're in laser work, uh, it's this is a great option for it. So there you can see the workflow, just how quick and easy it is to adjust throughout how I changed it so many times. Uh, but the controls really are, are super handy, right? Uh, you have pre-programmed uh, for standing, you have pre-programmed for sitting, you can go ahead and change those. Uh, you also have two other pre-programmed height adjustments that you can set. There is a child lock, which is huge for me, uh, as I have a little three-year-old who's in and out of the shop a lot. That helps. Um, there's lots of other features that this desk has going for it. Other features, right, we have a USB port. There's lots of accessories you can add on. I definitely use the anti-fatigue mat. Uh, use this little stand here. Uh, there's cord storage galore. All right, a couple other features. You can obviously add a drawer. There's different drawer attachments you can add if you wish. There's lots of different tabletop options. You can go longer, uh, you can go shorter, you can do different color materials, lots of options for you. Another thing, I did attach an inline duct fan underneath. That's just a great idea for running a laser machine. Uh, you know, the stock fans in these are, are decent, but really, even if you're just going out to get all the smoke out, for me, I just run out my garage, uh, getting one of these inline duct fans is great. Links to all the little accessories and whatnot down below, as well as if you want to learn more about my laser machines, the ones I use, affiliate codes, all that down below helps support the channel. Another feature I want to showcase is if you're in a space that's kind of tight, it does auto sense like a garage door opener. If I'm going down and there's something obstructing, like so, like I'm running into my table saw, it'll automatically stop. Uh, so it's not gonna crush whatever's underneath. It's not gonna damage, you know, my inline fan right there. It's gonna pop back up. Uh, the other thing about this one is it's got four legs. So there's a lot of other desks out there that are just, you know, two legs. It's a lot stronger so it can handle a robust machine, especially as that gantry on the laser is going back and forth a lot. Uh, so it can really handle it to, to ensure you're not having issues uh, with your project with it moving around too much. So really strong, really sturdy. Definitely check out online uh, their, their website, FlexiSpot, uh, to learn more about uh, this one and, and just why it's so superior some great videos and some more info there as well. Link down below. As promised, I want to talk about this little unit, uh, jig, little holder of, of sorts. This really improves your efficiency if you do a lot of laser cutting and you're doing layered signs like this, especially if you're planning to do, you know, something that's got like 12 layers, uh, like this mandala effect. New video on, on these things coming soon. But anyway, I've used in a lot of things, whether it's my ornaments, my, my chess boards, or sign making, I've shown that double-sided, uh, double-stick plastic uh, 
adhesive uh, that you put on the back of your material and you cut it with that material then you peel it after uh, and so super easy however if you're doing a ton those sheets can get really expensive uh, and you know using scissors can be cumbersome and so usually you want to buy one of these big rolls and so I'll leave a link to, to where I got this one uh, if you have other tips uh, on other systems that work other laser folk please leave comments or links down below uh, for myself and others uh, who watch this but all I did was just make a suit a simple box right just some scrap plywood I didn't take a lot of time on this I just wanted something functional uh, and so I just used three-quarter pipe through through the middle because I had it on hand I just threw a screw on the end as like a little stop there's lots of things you could have done and anyway it just rolls on there and then here, this is just a plastic cutter like you use for saran wrap or, or plastic wrap. And you can get like a four pack, I'll leave a link down below, super cheap, just a couple bucks. And then I just flip this over on the end and it just cuts. And so now I have whatever size I need on my material, I put it on, I run it through the laser and then I peel off the back uh, to attach. So uh, this is a super, super uh, handy, setup i had thought about like uh, the craft paper rolls or a butcher paper roll uh, you know how they have the rolls and you rip it like on butcher paper but i just didn't know if with the adhesive and this kind of it's not really paper it's more of like a plasticky material if that would rip um, so this is one like i thought about using maybe you would add like a a hacksaw blade or some blade on that, maybe something like that would work. But this is just a system that I thought would work well. Again, it's not super fancy. I'll probably rethink and, and do another version in the future, but uh, this definitely improves my efficiency insanely, especially when doing sign work or layered things with this double stick adhesive. So hopefully that tip helps you uh, a lot. If you're not already using this kind of stuff, uh, if you just need the sheets, I got links to that down below as well, but um, this definitely saves a ton of time efficiency efficiency so you've got the sheets you've added it to your material and then just running it right so again this is like a laser setup uh, it just works really well for me uh, especially having this auto adjust uh, this height uh, change just because as you're sitting there for projects when there's lots of layers or lots of different things um, you're standing for a while or sitting for a while so it just really helps uh, you want to stay here longer and uh, do more projects so here's that project that I did where I cut uh, and I'm just peeling off that back this is kind of a pansy floral uh, layered piece and so you just remove uh, the back side and then you just layer it all together this just saves a lot of time um, from doing like super glue and other ones, which does work in some applications, but especially these intricate designs uh, like so, uh, this really helps. So uh, this this desk really has been working well for me. I love it. It, it helps my workflow immeasurably. Uh, so I do highly recommend it. Uh, but there you can see this, this mandala effect, uh, more on this style in an upcoming video. Other ideas that use that double stick tape are like these ornaments. Uh, so all of these acrylic ornaments and the wood ones, the layered ones. I did that same thing where I layered uh, layered that. All of these, I have a whole separate videos on this if you're curious uh, how to make ornaments. Uh, layered signs, all of these. Some of these I might use that, that super glue, but a lot of those intricate pieces, I definitely use that double stick tape. Uh, here was my chess uh, board, chess set video, uh, especially all those little grooves right there those uh, those little dividers on the chessboard uh, definitely want to use that double stick tape just to peel off uh, here adding all these little inlay pieces uh, definitely help again I have a whole video on this chess set lots of other project ideas uh, if you're curious about you know my workflow more uh, seeing it uh, but also uh, these acrylic signs this is a, a recent video just showing all the layers where that double stick tape really really helps but just giving some ideas of that uh, why to go for that double stick adhesive ideas. So again, the only way these videos are possible is with sponsors. So yes, this is a sponsored video by Flexispot. They did send me uh, this desk. It's amazing. I only work with companies that I really do believe in and I feel are a good fit for the audience. And so this obviously is amazing for laser machines. However, this would be great for an office space as well. Uh, if you're doing a home office, right? It's so nice that workflow up and down, uh, especially if you're stuck at a desk for a long time. So it's a really great feature. I've messed around with a lot of different standards any desk before but this one has a lot of those bells and whistles that you're looking for at a great affordable price so uh, again if you want to check out more uh, about this one uh, information down below in the description
Additionally, yes, uh, all of my lasers, right, uh, are sponsored by Xtool. And so uh, if you're interested, I do have an affiliate link where we get a portion of the sale of these units. Uh, so if you're interested in getting them, uh, you can check that link down below, as well as you can watch my other videos where I showcase some of the different machines, uh, some of their, uh, their features, and just why I really do believe they are the best lasers out on the market, especially for the desktop units. So anyway, a little bit more salesy, salesy, but that's that's how the channel runs so appreciate it thank you so if this video provided value for you please consider subscribing to see more videos like this i have a lot a lot of laser videos all kinds of different projects uh you know chess sets got some upcoming more laser signs uh mandala effects like this one that you saw uh with this project so lots of other videos you can check those out down below uh links to all the stuff down down below anyway Thank you for watching. Until next time, take care.